This was used in a lot of different things. You get a lot of different elements of the body. Uh, if you go on my webpage, http colon forward slash forward slash augmentinforce.50webs.com, there is an iodine link there, and all the things they've used iodine for, from treating STDs, to increasing the immune system, to regulate the uh, uh, thyroid, regulate body heat. Some of you are feeling cold all the time. Some of you, you know, you, you go out, you, you're in the house, <coughs> whatever, and your hands are cold, your feet are cold, you know, you're always cold. That's thyroid deficiency. Now. To get iodine in the body more effectively, you would use selenium and tyrosine, all right? By adding those two components, you increase the availability of the iodine in the thyroid. And all three of them affect the brain, the heart. Selenium and iodine both impact the immune system. They make it stronger, make you more resistant to certain things like STDs and other unwanted issues. If you're eating soy products, soy is goitrogenic. In other words, it eats your thyroid, destroys your thyroid. Fluoride destroys your thyroid, destroys the iodine in, in, the, in the thyroid. This is why it's imperative that you do not eat soy. Um, contrary to what you've been told about soy, don't eat it. It's good for fertilizer, and that's about as far as it should go. Um, when... You, if you have a thyroid deficiency, whether you're hyper or hypo, quit the soy, quit the tap water, start using certain things like iodine. If you're hyperthyroid, you won't need as much iodine, you still need it. You may need ty tyrosine and more selenium and increased levels of protein in, to regulate the thyroid. Whatever you do, make sure you're not taking something that's attacking the thyroid direct or the hypothalamus. Uh, again, in conjunction with saturated fat. In another video, I showed you how to make uh, butter. In that butter video, I add iodine to it. Okay, the iodine mixes with the fat. It, when combined together with the saturated fat, will reduce body mass. All of a sudden, you're, you're lean. This is me. Okay, I'm flat. 52 years old. I don't train with weights. I used to years ago. Now the heaviest thing I do is walk, you know, carry groceries, whatever. The idea is if you know what you're taking in your body to keep all your organs healthy, this is what you'd want to do. Okay, this is one way, one way of doing it. It's not the only way, but it's one way. A lot of you have soy damage in the thyroid, soy damage in the hypothalamus. When you quit the soy and you get this going in your system and you get the saturated fats and the right ratios, you'll be surprised how all of a sudden you're feeling better, you're thinking clear, you're a lot stronger, you have less pain in the body, and you're more resistant to being sick, from getting sick, sorry. So, there you have it. Now, when you get done, let's sit for a day. I should have got the other one. Uh, let us sit for the day. The next day, pour it in a bottle and label it iodine. Lugo's iodine, because this is what this is. This is Lugo's iodine. This is not the store-bought stuff. The store-bought stuff is about 2%. This is more like 5 to 7%. This is a lot stronger. You don't need as much. Again, as you can see, it's still on my hand. It's still strong. Okay? And of course, the video hasn't really faded that much. By tomorrow sometime when I wake up, that will be gone. I've done these tests before. I'm usually good for 8 or 10 hours. So, you can do this yourself. Again, if you have any more, uh, need any more information, you can go on the webpage and get the iodine link. And again, you can contact us via through our email and through the information at the end of the video. As I pointed out earlier, this was produced by Grassroots Production by Dave Crissa. And it's because of him you get to see some of this stuff that you can do at home to get you prepared. And the one thing I want to drop here as well is Agenda 21, December 2009. It's supposed to be coming. Agenda 21. Go on YouTube, find Agenda 21, and get ready for Agenda 21. Something you need to be aware of. Okay. On that note, to your health, eh?